Hello, this is Rachel from Live Long Pilates and I'm here to give a short tutorial on the roll-up. The roll-up, we start lying on the mat. I'm going to show the full version first and then I'll show some modifications. So you're lying down on your mat. This is after you've finished your hundreds. You'll glue those inner thighs together and flex your feet. And we're feeling the entire body pressing down into the mat. You'll raise your arms up by your ears. And when you do this, watch out that those ribs don't splay open. We wanna keep them drawn together and down and melting down into the mat. Squeeze your inner thighs together, inhale. Exhale, we're gonna press those arms down as you bring your chin to your chest. And then from there, curl those ribs over the abdominals, squeezing those inner thighs as you round forward into your full roll up here. And then we'll squeeze those inner thighs as you roll back down. And you'll try to roll down one vertebrae at a time with control. Back down to the starting position. So that is the full roll up. Now, for many people, that's incredibly difficult. So we have some options here to uh, help us out. So you can roll up to the point where you get stuck. You can bend those knees, bring those hands behind the thighs, really squeeze those inner thighs together, and then use those arms to help yourself up. Alternatively, we can do the half roll back. So you'll have those knees bent, feet flat, pressing the feet down into the mats, and you can bring those hands behind your thighs, scoop the belly, and roll back as far as you can, and then roll back up, restacking the spine. So the half roll back is an excellent alternative to the full roll up if that isn't working for you. You can have the hands behind the thighs or to add more of a challenge, you can take those arms away. Inhale and then exhale coming back up. That, uh, this half roll back also works for uh, prenatal and early postnatal as well. That's perfectly healthy uh, to work. We're working the transverse abdominus muscle as you're rolling halfway back and back up. You don't want to do the full roll up if you are pregnant in your second and third trimester. Uh, so that's it. That is my short tutorial on the roll up. I hope that was helpful and uh, thank you for watching.